this shot used to be impossible. At least for me, because um, because previously, where's my camera? Because I was using this camera. This camera features a rolling shutter, which is used in pretty much all cameras. It's it's really really standard. What that means is every frame is captured on the sensor from top to bottom and because of that you can get some artifacts so you've you've maybe seen this wobbly lines crooked lines or what else like these these like spinning things like propellers or like stuff like that and also flickering lights flashes all of that you can't really capture with a rolling shutter that well. And yet I was able to get this shot and I didn't add any effect afterwards on the edit. I actually shot it like that. And if you wanna check out the music video, by the way, maybe it, it makes sense to that before watching this video. So check that out right here. We actually use these power tubes you see here in the back for this red flickering effect. The way I was able to get those shots was because of my new camera the red komodo because the red komodo has a global shutter and what that means is that the whole sensor gets exposed at once and it's pretty much exactly how old film cameras used to work because with film also every image was exposed at once and not from top to bottom so not only does it look way more filmic it also gets rid of all the artifacts let me demonstrate that real quick so here you can see some comparisons between the two sensors and if you're wondering why this tech isn't used in every camera out there it isn't because it's new tech global shutters are actually around for quite some years now even black magic has started using them in some of their cameras way back in 2012 one of the main problems used to be the lack of dynamic range you can capture with such a sensor but this has since improved to such an extent that red has even managed to put their global shutter up with their other hollywood level cameras with an impressive 16 plus stops of dynamic range so we might just see more cameras using this kind of tech in the future so yeah subscribe if you want to see more content like this and uh, if you did i'll see you very soon